Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. I look ridiculous, but today is a really big day for me. I'm here preparing for my first ever job interview since I graduated uh, six months later. But look who's here. Why are you there? So I knew that you were stressed and I decided to make you some brekkie. And I told you I didn't want to eat. Yeah, but you have to eat it. You made me granola? It doesn't look so nice. Oh, I forgot the chia seeds. That's okay. Look at this. Yeah, so Husband the of the year goes to... Thank so, you. Uh -huh. So I know you need some brain food. Yeah. This looks amazing right now. You see that, guys? <laughs> All right, let me bring you some chia seeds. Okay. Myself. So yeah guys, I have my first interview today at 10.30. It is now 9.55 and I work best under pressure. So I saved my like little research and like spiel for the last minute because I feel like I will remember everything that I try to go over right now. But anyways, um, before we get into the rest of this video, make sure you hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and um, just stick around to see how the rest of the day will go. Look at my lips, completely dry. I haven't gotten out of bed yet. I just woke up and started looking at this. Hi right, guys, it's crunch time. It's lunch it's time. Ab absolutely crunch time. Look at her in her interview shirt and sweatpants, but that doesn't matter. <laughs> That's besides the point. So how do you think you're gonna do? You're gonna get this? We'll see. You're gonna get this. It's right? my first one, so I can't really predict how. You're gonna, gonna get do. this. You're gonna get this, man. Okay. I ain't even worried about it. So. Face check. Ready to check on everything? Yeah. All right, let's go. Teeth good. Chin good. Ears good. Let me see your eyes. If you have anything in them. No. No. What about my hair? Okay. Good. Oh my god, why'd you touch it? Why did you go like this? Because I was turning around. Okay, am mm. I good? Yeah, you're looking like a baddie. Bad timing. Bad timing. You look nice, Avini. I'm sure you'll get it. Thank you. They're gonna look at you and they're like, damn, I want her in my way. I buttoned it wrong. <laughs> you're good. No, it's not. Oh uh, yeah. You, that's what you gotta start from the bottom, bro. My mom taught me that trick when I was like four. Oh, your mom couldn't teach you that because she's scared of the buttons, so... Yeah, true. <laughs> you look good, I mean. Sit down and be there. Okay, guys, so I'll see you after the interview. So that was intense. I've never sweat that much in my life. No, I'm lying. I sweat this much all the time. But yeah, that was pretty intense. Um, I think they liked me a lot, uh, but I am not sure. I'm not necessarily sure if this is the one I want. I have another interview tomorrow for a closer location, but that one is a overnight job, which would mean that I get paid more, but I don't really want to leave Simis home alone at night. But it was an interesting first interview. I didn't get any hard questions, but I'm an awkward person, so there were very awkward moments sometimes. But yeah, I think overall it went okay. All right guys, since your girl is now employed, I'm gonna be doing wife stuff and I'm gonna be cooking my man dinner. Oh yeah, that's right. I was gonna say and... employed. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm gonna be making these two salmon steaks or steak salmon, whatever you call them. Um, the thicker one is gonna be for Simis. Oh yeah. Thicker one for Simis and this little one for me, just for lunch and we'll have something else for dinner. Uh, but Simis, are you proud of your wife? Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's right.
I'm finally done seasoning up my fish. So I put it in the fridge a little because Simmons doesn't have his lunch break until like 2.30, so I'm not gonna start cooking it yet. So <clears throat> that's marinating and doing what it's supposed to do. And I'm gonna steam some um, broccoli and stuff like that to eat with it. But I wanted to touch base with you guys and um, just talk about why I really wasn't looking for a job right after when I was done with school. Uh, and it's something that I actually had to explain to the person that was interviewing me because they were asking, uh, so after August, we see that there is um, nothing else on your resume. So what were you doing um, after August till now? And I was explaining to the lady um, that I actually spoke with the executive director of the lab and uh, the supervisor of the lab. So it was really important people that I was talking to. And the executive director lady, she really, she was really nice and I think she liked me a lot. And she was asking, so where have you been? And I told her I was traveling, me and my husband, and we were in Europe and she was like, oh my God, I'm so jealous. I wish to go to Europe. And she was asking me, oh, do you cook a lot? Or, and I was like, hmm, this is a question that's outside the realm of the interview. But anyway, it seems like she's interested to know more about me. So that went really, really well, that part of the interview um of course another part i feel like i messed up on they asked if i am capable of multitasking and i'm a very honest person so my first instinct was to tell the truth so i said that it is definitely an area where i could work on but i'm willing to learn and simmons told me that you didn't say anything wrong you gave your most honest and your most correct answer and that's okay because simmons is more in in tune with this kind of um the work world than me of course because it's going to be my first position but anyways um and yeah that's one of the reasons why we didn't start looking for a job right away because this process has been happening rapidly i just started looking for jobs last week and i already have an interview already this week so today was my first one and i have another one tomorrow at 12 o'clock uh but yeah because my field it is very high demand it's in very high demand so the moment you get your license and you start putting out your application you're best believe that you'll be getting those calls so that's kind of like what i'm dealing with right now which is a great thing it's a great feeling because i i spend so much time in school and people are actually reaching out to me to work for them so it's it's um it's a good thing it's interesting and we'll see where it goes um definitely you guys will know if i got the job or not um in the next video obviously i'm not gonna know yet so stick around to see what happens and next time you see me your girl will be a working girl well not yet <laughs> kind of jumping the gun but anyways i'm kind of excited it's a new beginning for us so many new things happening and like i said we have a huge announcement that's going to be coming up pretty soon i think in the vlog after this so and the, the announcement is not about the job interview it's about a different thing that we have going on behind the scenes so stick around for that one um but yeah, I feel like I'm talking too much, so I'll see you guys later. Okay, so as you can see, we were both maneuvering the kitchen together today. And this guy was making a Mexican juice called horchata that we absolutely love. So it's time to taste test it. Should be good, mm. hopefully. Let's see. <laughs> it's good, but it needs to settle. Yeah. Oh, that's the problem. Yeah, because. Okay. Because it's from rice. Rice based. Yeah. There's rice in it. There is. Um, cinnamon stick, rice, um, almonds in it. Yeah, so it's a bunch of stuff that are kind of heavy. So after you like pour it out, you have to let it settle for a while because it's gonna be really grainy and you have to strain it off many times. But this juice, it's the truth. Anyways, let me not burn these broccoli. But we're about to have a feast. I'll show you guys what the food looks like so far. So this is it guys, we're eating good today. On the plate we have some fish, some sweet potato fries, 
and we have our greens and some broccoli garlic so this food is fantastic we're trying to work with the sun hence the weird camera angle but um i gotta eat because i gotta go back to work soon of course the is making all the possible noise right now just because i've started talking on the camera Sorry. look at this look what you you're didn't doing put the ice in the do you, you don't need ice in your chat what do you mean anyway guys it is lunchtime, and i am gonna like dive in and destroy this food right now and so i know nobody wants to see that so um what we're going to do is we're gonna say bye to you guys and we're gonna tell you guys to not forget to subscribe to the channel and stay tuned for an update to see if i can get this job or not or the one tomorrow but anyways guys bye we're gonna eat thanks so much for hanging out with us today and we'll see you guys next time